It's very simple. It's like you're kissing your grandmother or kissing a baby. Honestly, it's just a basic, that's it. <laughs> My name is Alexis Fraser and I'm otherwise known as Lipstick Lex because I am a lipstick artist. Yes, it is a little bit of a laborious process, I'm not going to lie. The kiss part is the wow factor, that's the part that gets people excited. I don't know how many kisses I put into one piece, but my lips will get dry and lip balm's my jam, yes. <laughs> I was doing so many different types of art, but I was trying to figure out what my niche was. I loved using mixed media, bottle caps, wine with beer. I even made a portrait of my dog with dog food. In 2012, I was actually about to create this portrait of Marilyn Monroe, and I really wanted to create her in an unconventional way that would correlate with Marilyn. And so the idea of creating her with a feminine product like lipstick and utilizing my kisses, because she was so famously known for blowing her kisses, this idea just came to me. And my husband wanted to film it and put it on YouTube, and it got such an awesome response. Here is one of my earlier works. This is a portrait of Sophia Loren. And back in 2012, when I just started, it was very simple. I used one layer of kisses, one color, but here is an example of a more recent picture of Sophia Loren. Different colors of red, a lot more depth because of the layers of the kisses. I started to realize, wait a second, I can get my hands on some pretty funky colors. So then I really started to branch out and develop my art even further once I had a full color spectrum. So this portrait of the very influential Lady Gaga, you can see the detail with the eyelashes, that was all hand painted, hand drawn. Italian restaurants, so we got, you know, Dean Martin, Frank Sinatra, Sammy Davis Jr., Perry Como. The customers say, well, this is great. And once I tell them that she kisses the canvas, they get out of their chair and they go, really go up and look at it, and they're like, oh my God, yeah, that's awesome. My lipstick art has really brought on some incredible opportunities. Put on lipstick with Michael Strahan. or just like little pieces. You know, I can go through anywhere from like one to three tubes, but I've done some very large murals, six feet by 10 feet. That I think required 65 tubes of lipstick. My artwork is so much about beauty and self-love and personal empowerment and positivity and just feel good vibes all around. Like any other parent, I would take whatever she drew and we stick it on the fridge, but it kind of looked like any other kids like stick figures, you know? It's not like we said, oh, we got a Picasso here, you know? The piece that I really like is the Audrey Hepburn portrait. She just captures Audrey Hepburn and all of her beauty and glamour. She's gotten this good in this amount of time. What's her stuff gonna look like when she's my age?